Ever wonder what really happens inside your body after you eat? It's not just about feeling full. There's a hidden microscopic drama unfolding, a metabolic timeline that dictates everything from your energy levels to your long-term health. Let's pull back the curtain on this incredible process. Okay, imagine you just finished a delicious meal, say a plate of pasta. As soon as you take that first bite, the clock starts. Phase one, the insulin spike. This is the first zero to four hours. As you digest those carbohydrates, they break down into glucose, which floods into your bloodstream. Your body's mission control, the pancreas, senses this sugar surge and deploys its primary hormone, insulin. Think of insulin as a key. It rushes through your body, unlocking your cells so they can absorb that glucose for immediate energy. It's like a massive refueling operation. Your muscles, your brain, everything gets a quick power up. Any extra glucose? Insulin helps store it in your liver and muscles as glycogen like packing away extra batteries for later. This is the fed state. Your body is busy storing energy, and all growth processes are switched on. Phase 2, the glucagon rise. This happens from 4 to about 16 hours after your meal. The party's over. The glucose from your meal has been used up or stored. Your blood sugar starts to dip. Now your pancreas releases a different hormone, glucagon. Glucagon is the opposite of insulin. It tells your liver, Hey, release those stored batteries. It starts breaking down that glycogen back into glucose to keep your blood sugar stable and your brain happy. Your body is now shifting from storing energy to using its stored energy. We're entering a fasting state. Phase 3. Ketosis kick in. This phase generally starts around 16 to 24 hours. Okay, the glycogen batteries are running low. Now what your body is incredibly smart. It switches to a new, more sustainable fuel source, fat. Your liver starts breaking down body fat into molecules called ketones. This state is called ketosis. Ketones are a super efficient fuel, especially for your brain. Many people who practice intermittent fasting aim for this phase, reporting mental clarity and stable energy because they're no longer riding the glucose roller coaster. And now for the grand finale, the autophagy switch. This kicks in after about 24 hours of fasting. This is where the magic really happens. Autophagy literally means self eating. It sounds scary, but it's your body's ultimate cellular cleanup crew. Imagine your cells are tiny houses. Over time, they accumulate junk, misfolded proteins, damaged parts, and general cellular debris. Autophagy is the process where your cells literally hunt down this junk, break it down, and recycle it into new useful parts or energy. It's deep cleaning on a microscopic level. This process is linked to longevity, reducing inflammation, and protecting against a host of age-related diseases. It's your body's innate renewal system, but it only gets turned on when the insulin and growth signals